Looking for super cheap, fast, and reliable Madden 21 coins? Look no further than my sponsor, MuttReserve.com. They're super awesome to work with, and their coins are currently discounted a ton. Make sure to take advantage and use code Poodle at checkout for an additional 15% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today, I'm going to go over the best set in Madden, guys. Haven't made one of these videos in quite a while because we haven't had a good set like this since I don't even know. What was the last promo when we had a great uh, match set like this? I have to say, Byron Jones was one of them. Don't tell me it was Byron Jones, right? It's been a while, guys. It's been a minute since we've been able to do this, but I'm super hyped to get into this video. Go over all the math. I got the calculator ready to go. Everything is all in place to go through this video. Now, if you guys don't know, I do this with every big promo because it's such an advantageous set to do, especially for budget teams. Like, okay, for God Squads, it's good. Like, even I could do it. Um, and I, I'm not a God Squad, by the way. Like, that's not... Okay, now let me rephrase. For even a decent to good team, it can be done. For God Squads, it can be good for uh, coin purposes. And then for budget teams, it's the all for budget teams or no money spent. It's the all around best thing you could be doing right now. But guys, before we get into the video, shout out to the Poodle Squad. Thank you guys for showing support. If you guys want a chance to be shouted out in today's Poodle Squad, like the video, comment down below Poodle Squad, and of course, turn the notification bell next to the sub button. Now today's Poodle Squad shout out is Steggy. Shout out to you, man, for being a part of the Poodle Squad. Thank you so much for showing support. And if you guys need coins or anything, head over to my reserve down below. Use code Poodle for an additional 15% off your order. Take advantage of the most of your discounts. Now moving on, guys. Let's head it over. So there's some prices we got to get before we get into the set, right? Let's mark these prices down. It's always important to get these down before we get into the video because it will greatly help us later on. So I'll, I like to show you guys the prices too. So you don't think I just make these up out of nowhere, out of thin air. So we're gonna go. We're gonna go focus on the most feared masters today. Now for the most feared masters, we got Russell Wilson. We got Troy Polamalu. So they're they're, they're clocking at around 300k. Right? We're gonna call it around 300k. Depends on the time of the day you find them, but they're averaging around 3 to 320. So we're going to average it between a 310 because obviously some are going to be in the low 300. Some are going to be close to 320. You can do Paul Amali, You could do Wilson. doesn't really matter. I'd probably recommend Wilson because he's a little bit more expensive. But so let's start with Wilson at three, uh, at 320 since we're going to go on the higher end here. So Wilson's 320. Now let's come over to the set. Now remember, you have to factor in the players you do end up getting from some of the solos and stuff as well. So we're going to go over to sets here. Most feared. And you're going to be to Scary Sharp. Now Scary Sharp, Russell Wilson set. Exchange both 90 overall scary sharp heroes, 187 overall scary sharp player, and 185 overall scary sharp players, or 92 overall scary sharp Russell Wilson, his power up, and his set returns both heroes back as that. So let's start with this. Dylan's going for 160. Now I wish you guys would have sniped him yesterday because he was so cheap, but Dylan goes for 160. So 160k plus he goes for 158k, which is Levante David. So then, that's 318. You're still breaking even on the set. And 87 overall goes for 49k. So that's 367,000. I believe these go for around 30k, right? So that is going to clock you at around 400k for the set. So if you were to do this set, right, it would cost you around 400k minus the Russell Wilson you could sell minus reduction 290k. So it would cost you 110k, and you get to keep both of these guys back. But that's not the methods, right? 110k, and you get two 90 overall players in your squad. And you get a power up you can sell for Russell Wilson for 110k. That's already a steal because Steelin's already more well 160 now. Here's where it comes into play. Remember, if you do play your solos, you get one free 90 overall player. And if you play the house rules, you get a free 85 overall player. So that's not even it, guys. You could also potentially get, if you play the solos, you do get the 83 to 87 pack. You could potentially hit an 87. So I'll show you the uh, where you don't get an 87 and where you do. So let's add it up again. So now it's a 150 for Levante David plus 49k for the 87 that's it you have you buy levante david you buy the 87 you have this for free and that for free you toss them into the set from the solos and now you have and make sure the 85 from house rules by the way if you guys didn't know you can probably pull from the solos too uh now you subtract that from so you subtract the 320k you're gonna get russell wilson for from 190k you just made 130k so if you do the if you do the set this is the method i recommend right here you do the set with the free players it costs you you will make 130k by the way if you sell Russell Wilson. So method one is you sell Russell Wilson. You do the set, you sell him. You end up with Adam Thielen and Levante David on your team. Free. Nah. Plus 130k. So you make 130k and get 290 overalls for free. Or you could go ahead and do method two, which method two is where you keep everything. Now this is more of like the uh the efficiency, you know, like if, if this a budget squad there's a first one where you guys need the coins. A no money spent team probably goes the route of keeping Wilson. So you can end up with uh so what you do now here is the set costs you 190k right so now for 190,000 coins you get russell wilson which is 320k you get adam thielen and you get uh, levante david so this one's going to cost you 190k but you get 
290 overalls and a free 93 overall Russell Wilson technically because you're going to be able to power him up as well with some training. So one of the best quarterbacks in the game, two great players on method two. Now that's a great method as well. Now that's the method I typically, I, I implore depending on the player. Now for Wilson, I haven't decided if I'm going to get rid of uh, Mike Vick yet. So for the most part though, if you do go that route, this one's going to cost you again, 190 K, but Adam Thielen alone is 160. Levante Davis 150. So you're getting two players, you know, for almost that same price. And you're also getting a Wilson on top of it. It's kind of like a free Wilson. And it's pretty much the way you get Russell Wilson for, for uh, just about free. The first method, of course, is the one where you make 130K. This one, you lose 130K, or 190K, I should say, but you end up making all these cards. You get all these cards for free. Then there's method three. Method three is a little more complicated. So method three is where you're trying to maximize all your coins. So again, you go back to the first set, right? You're looking at 320K total to sell Russell Wilson back, but it costs you 190K to do it all, right? That's, that's the math we're working with here, 100, 150 and 30K. So you made 130K, but now you end up with Thielen and you end up with um levante david but you're like i really don't want those cards right like you don't want them you don't you didn't want them all you want to do is get your free 130k i'm telling you about so what you do is you come on over to the store you go over here and you come over to special offers i'm not special offer, sorry, most feared and you're going to quick sell adam thielen and you're gonna quick sell levante david they're gonna have half their uh treat value take the treats you can you could probably get an 85 plus most feared player but if not you can go for the 79 overall most feared pack these packs are not a bad value and just keep uh, selling these back for like 4k a piece and so on and so forth so you can probably get like an additional 20 to 40 50k depending on what you end up getting and what your pack luck is out of this stuff with the 85 plus so you can take that route and what you pretty much do is convert thielen and levante david into coins and of course you, this isn't a repeatable set because then you're not gonna have the three players anymore now again if you get enough luck out of the solos with the 83 and 87 you could probably do it again for a decent price but again it depends on that it depends on the luck of course but like i said if you get that it's 130k plus an additional like 30 to 50k potentially maybe 20 to 40k you could end up looking at 160k plus off this so first method is 130k with two players second method is uh 190k deep but with three players and the third method is you get a free 160k now again my favorite one personally probably method one where you get 130k and two players because that, that's like you gain players and you make coins second method is my second favorite one where you get russell wilson and all the players and only cost you 190k now the third method i like for people who like a god squad right you literally can't start those players on there you can't start wilson you just sell everything quick sell everything and you take what you get from it that's probably the method for a god squad because clearly they can't use it and but for like a budget or no money spend you don't want to waste the deal on a Levante david even as a backup just for chemistries guys you can put lockdown on them like times two or whatever i definitely recommend you take advantage of that in that aspect but moving on from that guys you, you don't have to do it with the uh russell wilson set you can do it with the palomalo set as well the only difference is going to be the fact that Russell Wilson goes to like 15 to 20k more right now. So you're pretty much eating the reduction on a uh, triple Palomalu by going with Russell Wilson. Or you're not eating it, right? With Palomalu, you're eating the reduction on top of the already discounted price. You can do all those. Now, guys, in the another good theory or good method is if you do get some of those 83 and 87s from the, uh, the, the solos and you don't know what to do with them and you want to make a, a good player, you can toss them into here, exchange a few of the ones you get out of the solos into here and see if you can get luck and get yourself an 85 or an 87 overall that you can then toss into the set. Because if you're able to, if you're able to get yourself the 87 guys and the 85 from house rules and the free 90, it's going to cost you 160 K. And that's where the high end of outcomes comes, right? Where you can make a set of 130 K, you make an additional, you know, so, you know, cause that, that 89 overall is 50 K. So you make an additional 50 K. So you're making 180 on the last one. You're making like 220, you know, like that's where it gets better. But again, it really just depends on your luck out of those packs. So you pull 287, you could sell one, put one in the set. Depends on your luck. So on the lowest end of outcomes, you get a 130 K on the highest end of outcomes, you end up with over 200 K. So really just depends guys but either way i recommend you try this out always my favorite set and method to do every time this does get unleashed into the game and then of course you might say what about the potion one and then we get two free 90s i'm pretty sure the second free 90 is just going to be for the free cameron jordan from the potion so that's still a great player but i don't think it's necessarily the number one thing you want to be doing with um the number one thing you want to be focusing on i want to get the set down first that's it pretty much it for the video hope you guys enjoyed hopefully this video worked out for you guys hopefully it helped you guys out again always double check the math now the math will still work in a ratio but remember like so if i have 320 right now by the time you do this it could be 290 which would make instead of making 130 make 110 like things will change like no matter what if you follow that same strategy with two free players it's going to be profitable it's going to be beneficial but always check the math people are going to comment like in a month like oh this only gets me 30k now or in a week like oh uh russ wilson sells for 290 well that's very possible things do change day to day so just make sure you check it out it's gonna be profitable but just make sure you check it out so you're not confused at the end as to why the numbers are what they are that's what it guys enjoy the rest of your day down below poodle squad 
like the video and turn on the notify bell next to the sub button to, to, the, to be shouted out in the next video. And go on to my reserve to get any point training or solo grinding. Thank you guys for watching. I'm out. Peace.